today we have assembled here for a talk. Have an idea? You can patent. Let's begin the proceedings with a silent prayer. Thank you all. May I now invite Mr. Rajesh MP, Chairman, CSI Cochin Chapter, for the welcome address. Uh, thank you for inviting me. Uh, good evening to all. Uh, friends, it's actually really nice to see the good number of participants uh, for this session also. It makes it actually more encouraging, especially on a Friday evening like this. Today's session is taken by uh, none other than Dr. Sandosh Kumar, Associate Professor, School of Engineering, Pusat. And I think he doesn't need any introduction. And I think most of you already know him in person also. Dr. Sandosh Kumar, as a past chairman of CSI, has contributed heavily for the revival of CSI, which was otherwise in a state of hibernation for a couple of years. Of course, there was some obvious reason also for that. Though a formality on behalf of CSA coaching channel, I welcome Dr. Sandosh Kumar. Now I would like to Thank welcome you. The, I would like to welcome the new members who have uh, joined uh, CSI. And finally, I welcome each one of you to this technical session. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Uh, next, I would like to invite Mr. Suresh Kumar. Secretary, CSI Coaching Chapter, for speaking a few words. Thank you for welcoming. Uh, good evening, all. So um, today we gathered here to uh, listen from uh, Dr. Sandur sir. Um, he is giving a wonderful. He is going to giving a wonderful session for us. At the same time, I am welcoming the people those who are joined with us to understand what CSI is doing, because the intention of CSI is to connect industry and uh, uh, academic. That is where that bridging is happening through the CSI. So that is why we are in, uh, inviting the industry leaders, those who are working on the IT side of the industry. So we are trying to connect these industry specialists, IT people and uh, the academic, you know, the students. Thank you. Thank you all. Thank you, sir. Uh, we are very pleased to have amongst us Mr. Melvin from the Joe's Alucas group. I would like to invite Mr. Melvin to speak a few words and share his experiences with the participants. Sir, mute us, sir. Melvin, sir, mute. Sir, mute us. Hello. Yes, Hello. Can, yes, sir. You can hear, right? Okay. Yes, sir. Good evening, all. Uh, I am Melvin Jolie from uh, Joe Saracas. I am taking care of IT and software for the Joe Saracas group. Uh, it's great pleasure to be in a part of this uh, wonderful group of uh, Computer Society of India, those all members and those all other group members who have been participating in this meeting. And um, I know very well, Mr. Suresh is our uh, technical consultant for the IT and all our IT communications and all in the past two, two, three years. Okay, so it's great pleasure to be in part of this meeting. And, uh, and I'm very proud to be in this meeting to share all the needs and requirements from all the, all the team members. Thank you, sir. We are indeed very happy to have Mr. Tom, uh, IT head, KLM. May I invite Mr. Tom to speak a few words and share his experiences with the participants. Good evening, all. Myself, Tom, um, CEO of uh, KLM Microsoft Invest. Uh, for, uh, previously, I'm a student member in Calicut chapter uh, 20 years back. Now rejoining to CSI, it's a beautiful moment. Uh, I can thanking for the organizers for including me in this section. And uh, in this uh, startup era, 
the um, idea and the pattern is a very valid subject. I congratulate the organizers for selecting this topic. Thank you. Thank you, sir. It is indeed our pleasure to have Mr. Kapil Dev, Head IT Projects MyG, with us today. May I take this opportunity to invite Mr. Kapil Dev to speak a few words? Kabil, can you hear me? Hello? Hello? Yes, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, I'm sorry. Good evening, all. Uh, I'm, I'm Kabil Dev. Uh, I'm heading uh, my uh, IT department in MyG. Uh, most of the softwares, all the softwares in MyG, uh, my department is handling that. And thank you for inviting me in CSI Technical Talk. I'm so excited to hear from Sandor sir. And I'm so glad to be in this session. Thank you. Thank you, sir. I am indeed very pleased to present our speaker for today. A very familiar personality for all those who are associated with CSI coaching chapter and who uh, doesn't need any introduction at all. Dr. Sandosh Kumar MB, uh, Associate Professor, Division of Information Technology, School of Engineering, Cochin University of Science and Technology. Uh, he has previously worked as Assistant Professor in the same department, Head Department of Information Technology, American College of Dubai, Dubai. He has uh, done his PhD in development of innovative procedures for information technology articulated agriculture from Cochin University of Science and Technology. His uh, research interests are in knowledge-based systems, agricultural information systems, rainwater harvesting system, mobile computing, and distributed computing. He has held several organizational positions within QSAT and outside, and has got several publications in international as well as national journals, as well as conferences to his credit. He has also obtained a patent for his work portable agricultural network system. As we are all aware, he is also the immediate past chairman of CSI coaching chapter as well. Let me take this opportunity to invite Sandosh sir for the talk. Over to you, sir. Yeah, thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you, President, other CSI members, and our guest for the day also. Thank you very much. And uh, I welcome you all again to our CSI family. Yeah, for the uh, because uh, this is, I don't think that this is any much of a formal talk. Yeah, uh, we'll just see that how you know, we can uh, you know, have a uh, discussion on this one. So uh, what I'm trying to do is that I'll just try to share what all knowledge I have gained, what all experience I had, and my some of my students, PhD students are also there. So some of these you know, uh, ideas we are just trying to share among you yeah, and discuss so that, you know, why? Because uh, it is the need of the hour that we, especially the IT personals, IT professionals, and the people who are dealing with the uh, public as such has to think about the patenting concept because that has to be even started from the school days. Yeah, uh, because that's what uh, the main thought process that as a part of Rotary, I'm just taking it to the school level also. Yeah, because the thought process should start there. That is what even Abdul Kalam uh, Sarah said long back, no, you should start dreaming. So daydreaming, you know, not only night dreaming, yeah, to have the daydreaming also is very important you know, to get into that one. So he, in the, on all his books, if you just go through a lot of, you know, I happen to read his books and all. So you can see that a lot of real-time experiences. It's not like a story. You can see that stories are also there. But there are a lot of you know, uh, analysis which he has done, of course, maybe with the help of a lot of other people. But you know, a lot of analysis is done. So I've just taken uh, some of the uh, excerpts which he has made you know, in, in the analysis which he made in the patenting part. Yeah. Uh, so I think I'll just uh, begin with my uh, presentation. I hope you, know, you all can see in the, my screen. Is it visible and audible, Asha? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah. Yes, sir. Okay, thank you very much. Yeah. So basically, uh, this is you no. Know, I just put that uh, concept of you no. Know, if you have an idea, you no, know, you can patent. So 
any idea can be patent. So I'm just speaking only about the patents, what you can do in the Indian context, because I very much believe that you no, know, all the products and the concepts, you know, we have to develop in India or the make in India concept has to be encouraged to the great extent. So why? Because, you know, uh, I happen to, you know, been deputed to UAE also to work with an American college from Cochin University. So basically, we had students from all over the world because I happen to teach students from all, nearly all parts of the world, like you know, from US, UK, China, Japan, Pakistan, you no, know, India, everywhere. So everywhere we can find, or we I found that you no, know, the idea and the concepts of what we Indian students has is something uh, above. You know, I can say that, or it is you know very competitive or on par with the students or the thought process of the you know China or Japan. Yeah, or US people, or maybe sometimes even more than that. So that's why basically, you know, I thought, you know, when we came back also, we just wanted my guide, you know, Professor Kanans and the previous uh, president also. So we have been also working see, to see that how we can fit in. So it was a very difficult initial stages. I had to, you know, go through the um, lot of uh, you know, persons, people, you know, uh, professors, you know, uh, faculties, you know, a lot of people. To you know, have an uh, to have a discussion on or to get an idea about you know, how can we patent you know, uh, any of our idea or concepts. Okay, so it was very uh, difficult to you know, get into this because I happened to go to the Mumbai, you know, Chennai, yeah, and even Trivandrum also to get a you know, uh, lot of information, but even the information was not much but today uh, i'm happy to introduce that even in kuchin university we have an ips cell and uh, ns gopal christian sir uh, nsg in short yeah he was the person who made his full effort to have this established in uh, kuchin itself yeah central part of kerala and any person can and since this being a government yeah you know it's a government university uh, you can get the services at the you no know, uh, the minimal rate or the government rate okay so i'll just have an uh, interview uh, introduction about you know the ipr part how can we go for uh, the you know then introduction how can we do the patenting and what are the you know stages for patenting and uh, where are the you know what are the patent offices we have and uh, how or what just a format of uh, you know the uh, patent yeah published and how the patent is granted Okay, so normally <clears throat> when we think about patent, it's just like a nightmare. No, you cannot do it. So once I discuss with my one professor, he said, no, 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 patent is a big thing that will see only IITs and IACs only can do it. So again, we was, you know, again, put lower. So again, you no, know, but I always had a faith that, you no, know, if you put a, you know, uh, um, effort for sure, we can, you know, do that one. Okay, so this is <clears throat> some of the analysis. This was there in uh, APJ Abdul Kalam's book also. So in that one, we were on the 21st ranking. So this is the patent applications for the top you know, 20 countries. It's just a glimpse. I took it from the um, Google only. Uh, the other thing which uh, in Abdul Kalam's uh, book was there, you know, there our ranking was you know, 21. You see, so there's a lot of uh, no, a tremendous change which we have seen. And this and you see, it's an analysis or the you know of the 2019. Yeah, you can see that we were we are standing on seventh rank. Yeah, and uh, no more than see if I still you can just see that just see the China. See when we compare the population and when we compare the patency, you can just have a look at that one. See, it's around 14 lakh, and we are just only 53,000. Yeah, when we compare with the top people. Okay, so I think you no, know, that's the need of the hour. What I think that we have to you no know, start thinking and you no know, come about or you no know, make anybody say age is not a bar. Any person, at least I think here around 35 or 40 people are here. Even you can start thinking about you no know, patenting now. Yeah, and it's not a big deal. I'll tell you the pricing also. Then you no, know, it's we spend a lot of time for you no know, many things, and this is a thing which you are making it for not only for this generation, it is for generations. For 20 years means it's for generations. Okay, so this is again about the uh, the patent granted. Yeah, and that's again you can see that <clears throat> we are again on the you no know, seventh rank. Yeah, and that um, series that uh, it's not in the sequence like, but you can just see that still again China, US, and Japan. You no, know, are the people who are still on the top. Yeah, again we have uh, the 
in the case of you know granting of you know uh, patents also you can just see that see 4 lakh 50 000, 52 thousand yeah around 5 lakh is china's and we are only just see that only 23000 okay so again uh, 2021 and all uh, not in a marginal of course this little bit of increase but we are you know the same position as on date also so i am not saying that we should come to the first at least we can try to reach to at least among the first three so at least if we everybody make an effort i am sure we can reach to that because we do right, we take degrees, we do uh, postgraduate, we do uh, research, we publish journals, but patenting is also the same effort only. Yeah, nothing more than that. Only thing is that we are just you no know, frightened with the tag. No patent cannot be done by common people. It is only some done by you know uh, Einstein or you no know, only such you know our IIT people or IAC people or something of that. No, that's a wrong notion. Anybody can do it. Yeah, and uh, uh, nearly all of my uh, PhD students also they are you no know, they are doing it, and you can just uh, you know <clears throat> they they'll be also talking to you in between. Okay, so I'll just uh, begin with the intellectual you know, property rights. Yeah, you can just see that. You know, so it's nothing but the exclusive rights granted to the owner of the said property. See, again, see if you, you can you know, file a patent yourself or through an organization. If it's through an organization, the patent goes to the organization. If you patent it in your name, the patent will be remaining in your name. This is all of the simple basic things which you have to take care of. Yeah. Okay. So the exclusive rights granted to the owner of the said property, you know, for its exploitation, subject to the provision of national laws and international agreements with a view to reward the intellectual creativity. That's basically, you know, the thing. So basically, to put in simple words, any idea, any concepts you have, you can get it patented. Okay, and uh, basically invention. So see, actually, you know, we, we, you all, we all are doing a lot of inventions actually daily. Only thing is that we don't take the pain or we don't, you know, bother for, you know, getting it, you know, uh, patented. That is basically the thing. So when I was in the National Service uh, Scheme and Assess Coordinator for the, you know, Cochin uh, University covering all Kerala, I happened to meet, you know, many of the farmers from Calicut and so, and there was, you know, a particular type of even rice, yeah, which was US has taken it and they patented it. Our people doesn't know that. See, just see the joke of the thing. Our product, our item, which is good for cancer and all other things, a specified, you know, breed of rice that is being patented by the US. Okay, so that's what you know, we are even you know, the farming. I, I mean, and basically I look onto the agriculture technology and agriculture domain. So we are just trying to see that you know, each and every idea or concepts you can you know, get it patented. So invention means a new product or process involving yeah, an inventive step, yeah, inventive step and capable of industry. See, uh, basically what happens is that why we have more patents in IITs and IICs and now to a great extent into the NITs. Why? Because major or in uh, bits Pilani, the, basically because they have the industry directly linked to them. So whenever a product, either a professor or the students, they do it, automatically they get you know, um, connected to the industry. So that get patented first and you start you know, getting the royalty or whatever it may be or the product is being there. Okay, so that's why you might have read about the you know uh, IIT students from Chennai making you no know, for five lakh you no know, house in the 3D modeling and all. So this is all basically why because you no know, uh, this uh, concept or the patenting agency the you no know, the nearness of the you know patenting agency number one and the industry application also on the product whatever you make that's basically the important thing. Yeah, but of course, there are a lot of people from the academy, they do it only for their, either for the promotions or no, uh, let's say for their you know, PhD award. That is another aspect. Okay, so a patent, it's nothing but a grant of exclusive legal, it's a legal right by the government of India to the applicant. Basically for the disclosed invention, whatever you're disclosing it. And of course, it's for a limited period. Limited period means it's not a small period, it's just like a span of around 20 years. Yeah, so which is offered only in the country where you no know, patent is granted. So I am just discussing only about the patent of the Indian patenting concept only. 
I'm not, there are a lot of US patent, Australian patent, you know, uh, N number of other patents are there. I'm just concentrating on the, we have a number of things, but not for your information also, whenever you patent this, again, that was a wrong notion which I had. I thought when we make an Indian patent, it is being only, you know, vetted with the Indian, you know, journals or Indian patent. No, any patent, anything you're going to vet, it is vetted with the global not only with the Indian. So whenever it is vetted with US, UK, you know, Japan, China, everywhere, then and only then only you will be getting the patent. So whenever you go for other things, the fees are high, that's all. So actually the government has to take, you know, really an initiative for this one, which I have put forward by my media, even you can also put forward to all the state and central governments to see that, to encourage this one, because, uh, you know, basically, if you are, if our country or if our students or if our nation has a number of patency, that means we are really protected. Okay. So that's what, so basically that's you know, a patent looks like. So in inventor with the government, we have a 20 years of agreement. That's well enough and more that, you know, for uh, if it's in the revenue point of view or even the academic point of view. Then another thing is that about the, you know, uh, when uh, basically what you have to do is that you have to satisfy the novelty, the inventive step. And as I told you, it has to have an industrial applicability. That is again, very important. Yeah. But if you ask me, is it mandatory? No, it's not mandatory, but no, that will be easy for you to you know, get it, you know, uh, industrialized or get into the field of the market. No patenting time. I told you normally the patenting time it's for 20 years, yeah. So what happens then after 20 years? So after 20 years, the patent normally comes into the public domain. That means all the details you have can you have to you know disclose it. Anybody you know anybody can do it, yeah. So that is basically the full disclosure of the invention, yeah, by the applicant. Okay, just like you know that you no, know, even that good night Mohan. I think some of you might be at least my you know remembering or those who you know especially people from native of Kuchin. No, who has the most mosquito bite, you know, that good night, no, nobody will forget. So even that was the equipment which was thrown away by one of the you know, foreigner in our country. So from there, that concept of you no know, mosquito repellent came into the concept. And that's how you no know, good night Mohan came up with the concept of a very small equipment because that's a simple, very simple electronic. Those who seen open that one, you might be knowing it. It's just a simple heating element with you no know, a coil, and then you have a mat for you know the fumes, which you no know, uh, let's say uh, repels the mosquito from them. So that's what any idea, anything you no, know, you have, that's what. So the field of invention, see, more or less, I can say anything under the sun, you can go for PTD, but only some you know, exceptions are there, yeah, which comes under the section three and section four. I'll come to that. Too. Yeah, anything under electronics, anything in computer applications, but you have to see that if anybody has, uh, else has come up with that one or not. That is very important in chemistry, in bio, in nano, in Ayurveda, in anything, anything in medicine, whatever you feel, you know, everywhere you can do the PTD. Only thing is that you have to have a you know, um, search that if this thing uh, exists or not, or if somebody has published it or not. Only, only that is a you know, simple task, but that's not a major task also. Even for that one, we have a lot of consultants also. Okay. See, for example, when I went to the, uh, our one product, which we made, I come to that one, yeah, mm -hmm. which is basically for protecting the banana plants. So I just went to, you know, Trichur, you know, you might have heard about Ayur Jack. No, the person who is having, you know, selling jackfruit for, you know, uh, he says that jackfruit will be there for 365 days. Yeah. So when we went for selling that one and uh, when we explaining this one, I observed that his, you know, plant, you know, his jackfruit is only our arm length only. It's only our arm length. Okay. So I said, no, then the, no, you can see 20 or you can just Google it. You can see that, you no, know, uh, around you know, 50 or 25 to 50 jackfruits are hanging. So he has you not know, tied and kept it. So we gave our this particular you know, product for him. And he said, yeah, that is very good. You know, so we actually went for banana plants, but that was a new application which can be used for you know, even all flexibilities and even for jackfruit, which even we never knew that one. It can be used for jackfruit. Okay, so that's what I'm saying. So a lot of uh, areas, a lot of things which we all can explore. The yeah, only thing is that just keep your mind open and see that you, know, you can you know, reach to the or uh, no, uh, 
leads to the or identify what all are the you know, problems which we have. See, because you know, even you can think about a lot of you know how we can use the solar energy, how we can make some of the incinerators, which I have been telling or discussing with my students. Yeah, a lot of things which we can do, just waste disposing, waste, no garbage disposable or portable things. You know, many things which uh, with the available resources, how we can use it. Okay. So, uh, yeah, so patentable subject matter is basically, as I told you, either it should be a process or a product or it can be both of it. Yeah. And only thing is that it has to be novel or it has to have something invention or inventive. And I told you uh, again, if it is you know, industrial applicable, that will be very, it can be, you know, it's easily catched by the, uh, the public. Okay. Or the, you know, common man to the uh, industrial people. So, okay. And I, as I told you, only thing is that uh, there are some of the categories which does not fall in the patentable. That's basically which comes under the section three and four. Yeah. So that is basically this is the thing. Yeah. You have the non patentable and you know, uh, under section three, you know, frivolous inventions. Yeah. Uh, inventions contrary to you know, well established natural laws. Yeah. So commercial exploitation or you no know, primary use of you know, invention, which con which could be contrary to the public order or you no know, morality. No, we cannot do against you no know, such you know, rules and regulations. You no, know, that cannot. Then causes serious you know, prejudice to health or human or animal or plant or you no know, any of the you know, natural or the environment. You no, know, that is all you no know, are not patentable. Yeah, and. Uh, other thing is that uh, anything related to atomic energy, nuclear energy, no, this is are also not no patentable. Then why do we or what is the need for no advantages of no patenting? So basically, to a great extent, it avoids a duplication of research. So if one person is doing in one part of the world and other people, so that's why we have the journals publication. So you know, 20 or 15, 20 years. Back, it was very difficult because you have to go to the you know library, you know, get the journals which have been published to check that one. So many times you can see the duplication. Now, anyhow, everything is on online. And even for the researchers, also it is very helpful for you to see. There are no Google patent, is there and a number of other websites are also there. I'll show you that one. You know, you can just check that if you're patent, but don't give see, even they keep the log also. So see that don't give the correct is the same. Keyword which you are looking for, you'd see or no put the keywords which are you no know, somewhat near that one. That will be easy for them to you no know, uh, keep abreast with the you no. Know. And so basically, uh, you no, know, this keeps you know you the researchers you no know, abreast with the latest uh, development in the different fields of technology. That is another important thing. So either it's a student's point of view, a faculty point of view, or an industrialist point of view. You no, know, you know that one. It is very mandatory. And I think I think we have some people from the industry also. So to a great extent, uh, as my some of my friends in US Central who have been working, so they are also have to do the patenting, but the patenting goes to the uh, company, even some of our my students also working in Bosch and other company. Yeah, they are also you know have to produce you know patents, but you no know, the patency goes to the company. Okay, so uh, of course they will be a part of the team only, but the uh, filing will go to means the all credit goes to the company as such. Okay, so this helps industry to improve existing technology to produce cheaper and uh, better product as well. And then I'll just uh, go through some of the stages of filing you know for granting a patent. Yeah, so this is are the simple. Put. I just put it a simple way that you no know, anybody you know can just read it, can understand, and you can just do it, and it's not a big deal at all. That's what I first of all, as I told you, anybody can think about the patent. If you have an idea, you can patent it. Okay, so filing of application at the patent office, you can uh, make a filing. Now everything you know, everything is online. You can make a request. You no, know, after the patenting, you know, after filing it, yeah, you can uh, file a request for examination. You have to public. You know, you it goes for a publishing or a publication, and the examination will be there at times. So sometimes there will be some just like you know whenever you just like our open defense for the PhD or any of the paper you know before publishing that will be checking with that one yeah with the whole uh, you know uh, data uh, the database you know if any you know body has been done or not of that sort so we have a pre grant opposition also 
then you know we go for the granting even after granting also opposition can come up with so we have to come up with and see i take it in a positive way that you no know, whenever any you no know, complaints or anything comes so that will be the chance for the inventors to think again and come up with some more novel ideas and to so that you can overcome such you no know, problems so obtaining a patent as we just said you have to file an application for patent this is one of the patent officers or the based uh, on the territory or the jurisdiction in, of near to your office or residence yeah uh, then pay the requirement fee yeah then uh, information uh, concerning all the applications you can have from this particular website ipindia.nic.in slash online you will get all the details online yeah and guidelines for applications yeah, are available in this website okay anybody can go to this website so the say formality check like you no know, so an examiner checks the formal requirements before accepting the application and the fee this is done immediately so they make a search and see that if this particular title and the abstract you no know, uh, is uh, worth for patent if not they will come up with you know some of the uh, you know similarity you know searches which has been made and done and they will come up with the and then, you know we have the attorneys also are there who will be helping you no know? and they are basically the intermediaries between you and the patenting office okay so there's an issue of you no know, application number and the cash receipt also okay so publication is basically so application is kept secret for a period of 18 months yeah from the date of uh, filing so from 19 month the application is published in the official journal Uh, if there is no any you no know, opposition or objection yeah in that one yeah and uh, normally this is available online also and it uh, is updated by weekly also so once that is over then you no know, we make the request for examination so again the patenting office they will take care of or they will be we won't have any connection or any idea who is going to make the examination on that one so uh, depending on that or, or after uh, receiving the application the examination Uh, is done and the request for examination can be made either by the applicant or by the third party okay then a request for examination within 48 months there yeah, from the date of uh, priority can be done am i audible is it clear are you getting it or what asha yes sir yes sir yeah it's uh, sir, audible yes sir. yes you okay. yes, are very much audible yeah yes. okay i don't know if i am dragging am i not dragging right i think you are getting i'm just speaking to the point only Yes, right? sir. Sure, sir. Sure. Okay, then uh, as I told you, we have the examination. Yeah, we have the examiner who undertakes the examination whether the claim, you know, invention is not you no know, prohibited for you no know, grant of patent or not. That will be checked, and whether the invention meets the criteria of patentable. I told you, you know, we have to say there should not be any you know duplication of that world, any part of the world or any journals or you know, and this product or you no know, the product or either the concept, whatever you. coming up that should not be published in any of the journals or any in the public domain that is another very important thing yeah so you can publish it after your patent filing is done once you get the filing uh, file number you can do all whatever you want you can do anything and everything that paper can be published then you can you know give uh, send it for journals and so on then issue of the you know that's a uh, first examination fir we call it as the examination report so that normally takes you know uh, up to maximum of 3 months is available to the examiner to submit the report to the controller so if there is any you no know, changes or errors or some queries or the thing which the team has said we have to go through that one so one month time is available for the controller to get the examiner's report yeah and uh, fir uh, containing the gist of the objections is issued within 6 months from the date of filing the request yeah and the response from the then the candidate also is given you no know, 12 months time yeah this all i am saying in the normal or a you know normal track not fast track in the normal track so 12 months time will be given from the date of issue of the fir and uh, app, the application you know uh, is available to see the uh, one important thing is that the applicant cannot add any new things to it that is very important only thing is that what all we have filed we have to justify we have to bring the proof or uh, yeah or any you know uh, uh, algorithm so whatever you are developing yeah that has to be proved to the thing what you have filed nothing new can be added to that's again another important thing yeah if objections are met now yeah, grant of patent is uh, uh, approved by the controller within a period of you no know, one month time okay 
then pre grant opposition, as I told you. So after publication, an opposition can be filed within a period of six months if there is just like you know, any our journals or no uh, uh, PhD. You no, know, we put the you know pre synopsis presentation. We made it, we make it you know public and say that if anybody is there to oppose it. That's you know normally. Then after that period, you know, depending on some PhD, maybe after two months, depending on the university. Yeah, here we say it's a maximum period of six months. Yeah, and the opportunity of hearing the opponent, you know, is also available for that one. Then examination of the pre-grant opposition. So normally, you know, the documents is sent to the applicant. Yeah, and a period of you know three months is normally allowed for the you know receipt of the responses. Yeah, that's basically the examination of pre-grant. Yeah. And the granting of a patent. So a certificate of patent is issued normally, as I told you, within seven days. Yeah. So grant of patent is published in the official journal also. So once it's published, as I told you, it's valid for 20 years. Well, this is just the, uh, the various um, steps which we normally use for the <coughs> what you call the, you know, the patenting part. Okay. So you can just see that one here. Yeah. Yeah, uh, you can see the conceptualization of an invention. Yeah, uh, any idea you can yeah come up with. Yeah, then uh, filing of the application. Yeah, mm, then uh, with uh, see to now they say that with all with the complete specification that's you know, important. Or you can go for the uh, provisional one. So two aspects are there. Yeah, so with provisional as you know, specification. Then filing complete within you know, 12 months after provisional. And if you can't do it, then normally that get automatically abandoned because many times you know, people go with it, file it, then they forget it or you know, they may not be able to complete. So automatically they get you know, abandoned. So if you file that one with all the complete specification, you, know, you can you know, uh, make the you know, publication yeah, uh, early or you no know, post you no know, 18 months. You can do that one. So within 18 months, you can go for the publication. Then you can go for the request for the examination. Okay, on form 18 within 48 months from the date of the priority. Okay, then once it is done, then they go for the what examination, yeah, uh, and the uh, patentability and other requirements. Yeah, as I told you, if there is any corrections or any changes or any objections, so that all will be you know sent across. They will be giving a report like. So all that reports, you know, and of course, that's the language is a bit different. That's why normally, you no, know, uh, we take the help of the attorneys or you can do it yourself also by reading that, you know, I don't know how many of you have gone through the, you know, pat you know patent. So reading a patency, you know, if you read the full patent, you'll get a little bit of headache because the terminologies, what they use, yeah, and all is, it is a bit different, like, you know, not the common English language which we are using. But once you're used to it, it is very clear because the inventor is very much clear about what he has done or his idea or his you know, process or his product, whatever it may be. So he is very clear about that. So what are terminologies come in between? You have to only see that your concept and your idea is correctly conveyed. They'll be using a lot of you know, legal terms. You don't have to worry on that one. Okay, then finally, the FER is you know, issued. Okay, so uh, first examination report is given, issued, as I told you, you know, your re-examination of the amended documentation has to be done, means you have to make the corrections, what all changes, you know, what they have pointed out, that has to, as I told you, you have to justify, or if any experiments which you have done earlier to justify that one can be, shown. no new anything cannot be done. Okay, controller offers a hearing to the applicant and application is to be put in order within 12 months from the issue of the uh, FER, first in, uh, examination report. Okay, so if, if again objections are not met within 12 months, again that is rejected. And if it is met within 12 months, then the patent is granted. Yeah, and if there is any post grant, uh, grant opposition is there, that will be also taken care of. But mostly, very rarely, only in the companies, you no, know, like you know, uh, they go for the. See, for example, you know, um, what was that? Uh, I forgot. Uh, what, it, what was the Suresh sir? Who's what was the person who bought uh, this internet and all to India? What was his name? Internet, you no, know, during Rajiv Gandhi's period. Uh, Sam Petroda, yeah. Sam Petroda, you know, uh, see, when he was in the, you know, Chicago airport, when he was, you know, traveling the airport, uh, no, he was in the airport, he saw, um, you know, people using that Casio digital diary, you know, Casio digital diary and doing that. 
and again he went and closely was he never knew that no cashiers come up with that one so he went and asked them can you just show that one and they all even i used to have that cash or digital diary many of you might have earlier before the mobiles was out yeah there was the digital diary yeah then he said oh then he thought because this was the uh, thing which he patented uh, two years back yeah so he has the patent for the, of course that you no know, it was not made a, a commercial product as such but he has patented you no know, that uh, digital diary as such so again he has to you know he sued the casio and you no know, uh, i think he got around uh, 1 million or 2 million dollars as a compensation so every piece you sell it he gets the royalty you know so that's very important that's basically the advantage so any uh, product which you you know patent if somebody is trying to make you know out of it you can sue them and you will get the compensation also okay so normally that is the neck to neck competition that's what's happening in the you know uh, it industry especially in the electronic industry also yeah the, because you come on samsung comes with one thing uh, iphone I, apple will come up with another one then lg will come with that so you have to have a neck to neck competition so that you no know, none of the and you know every you know new model of mercedes benz at least 15 to 20 patents are there all new models of you know mercedes benz they come up with of course they might be with other cars also at least 15 to 20 patents will be there inside that and that will be coming to indian cars after 5 or 10 years minimum okay so that's about the patenting and this is some of the patent offices which we have in india we have the ipr intellectual property offices here yeah, india yeah uh, in kolkata yeah uh, the head office delhi chennai and mumbai yeah and this is some of the websites yeah providing free access to the patent database yeah ipindia.nic.in yeah uh, then pfc.org.in then uh, us uh pto.gov yeah worldwide e space net.com yeah then patentscorp.vipo.in these are basically you no know, various patents you know which can be you'll be getting an idea of you know uh, where you can have an access to the various patents you know in the country yeah and uh, you can identify the you no know, uh, the keywords also the understand the innovation invention select the keywords for the purpose you know all alternate you yeah uh, purposes of invention then the composition yeah uh, whatever you no know, what all contents are there that whole thing can be there then the device name yeah again it is you know uh, the purpose oriented and the the further comes type yeah and help from text of relevant documents and the ips Uh, ipc manual okay this is uh, basically you know this uh, um, information i got from uh, mr basir when he uh, you know conducted one of the you know uh, session on it yeah so avoid using general terms like machine equipment composition yeah so you have to be very specific on which area you want to be okay so for example if it's blockchain iot yeah so what in, in you know agriculture so that way you know the searching can be done or say uh, something known as you know uh, image processing yeah or in agriculture yeah or into a particular plant or in particular area like that you can just just narrow down to the you know concept you know where you want to do yeah. okay so this is uh, one of the you know patent published by one of my student yeah ninu uh johnson yeah uh, faculty from fisat yeah uh this actually was a little bit of a fast track like no i think around 3 to 4 months we got 4 uh, to 5 months i think ninu is there online yeah yes sir yeah yeah we took how many months for this one to get published um nearly 3 uh, months i think yeah, uh, february yeah. we have started sir yeah uh, we have started in february uh, this work uh, then uh, we got published in july July, yeah. Last See, uh, so it's an, just like fast track; it can be done. So only thing is that, as I told you, it's a farm chain intelligent network system. You know, we gave a name also, Fins. Like, so any any of the things we work, you do a little bit of brainstorming. Of course, a little bit of brainstorming is required. Yeah, and uh, you know, uh, you can get the uh, what you call the, the patent can be published. Yeah. and uh, this is again we i have one more patent which we have done that is for protecting yeah i did not put it here it's for you know protecting i my guide the guide you no know, kanan sir and uh, sunil sir from pulingun uh, the former principal we together we did it an interdisciplinary we did a, uh, it is there in google you can just type it banana protection then you know the whole details will come up so it's basically you know uh, basically for protecting the banana plants you know from wind strong winds and as you all know that india is the largest producer of banana in the world 
So I was just trying to you know, fill that gap that you no, know, uh, but we are not the you know, largest exporter. You know, just I was just trying to fill that gap, you know, for that one. So major, major majority of the farmers had that problem because of the heavy bunch, you no, know, and wind you know, coming and breaking. So we just uh, came up with a product. You know, actually we had the concept of only process initially, but uh, no. Fortunately or unfortunately, we went into the you know the product part of it, yeah. Uh, and uh, of course, it took a lot of uh, time. Also, we had to get it do it in you know different uh, lab, the civil lab, in the uh, polymer science, in the stick, in the uh, and lot of process from. Uh, uh, no, ship technology and the Mars are and all no, helped us and motivated us. No, this can be because initially we always have a doubt. No, if we are doing it because when we are doing this one, you know, bringing banana, you no, know, stem and into the civil lab, yeah, and uh, no, taking the you no, know, finding the strength of the materials, you no, know, finding the uh, you no, know, the density. Uh, you no, know, people were there were laughing. Yeah, <laughs> initially even we also had a doubt that if this is true or not. Yeah, understood. Because you know, civil lab is you know it's for you know breaking the you know beams and you no know, hollow you no know, bricks and all. But uh, you know, coming up with the you know what you call you know very slender stem of banana plants was you know it was initially a joke. But all the people from the lab also were very cooperative. They all, we all designed a lot of gauges also basically to get the uh, you know uh, measurement from that one. Yeah, but of course, no. The, that was the thing, no. So why a IT guy doing in, uh, no, so doing in civil lab? Why this guy is doing in polymer science lab? No, this was the initial lab. Even initially, uh, even myself and no, Kanan sir, no, my, had a doubt, no, is it correct or not? We doing it. But we did all the analysis using the, of course, that's where the IT and computer science comes into it. All the data was collected and we did it in the ANSYS one software is there. We did all the you know, real time you know, simulation, we did it in that one. And we did it practically also you know, in, in the field. Yeah, and it was success as well. Okay. And uh, many of the farmers across the country, they are uh, now doing it. You know, we made an MOU with an in a company also. Yeah, and you know, the product is now moving on. Okay. And this is another, this is how the patent, you know, once granted it, how it looks like. This is also a guide condenser and his student came up with, yeah. This is how the granted patent will look like, yeah. And this is, yeah. So you all can have this thing, you know, in front of you also. This is just some of the statutory fees, which uh, uh, I took from the, uh, the um, slide, which uh, our IPR cell, you know, uh, uh, officer, uh, uh, associate professor, that is sir has done it. Yeah. So this is the you know on what payable. You no, know, you can see the fees payable. You can see that on application of the patent. Yeah, natural persons and or startups. Um, Indian rupees. How much it is coming? Yeah, for e-filing and for physical filing. Yeah. <laughs> Sandur sir. Takka Am I audible? If a sir is takka, it's your turn. I think he is discussed. Asha, am I audible? Uh, now it's audible. Yes. Hello sir. Sandur sir. Asha, am I audible? Yes, sir. Hello, sir. Sandal, sir. Yeah, am I audible, sir? Sandal, sir, audio connect to London. Yeah, am I audible or not? Yes, sir. Suresh, sir? Kelka, sir. Sandal, sir, I'm going to Hello. 
ഓഡിബിൾ in between if anyone have queries you can put it in chat box we can discuss dear participants if anyone have queries you can put it in chat box we can discuss audible now yes sir yes yeah okay i think okay right. sir good evening sir yeah yes i i have come one query sir yeah yes sir so in march uh, i was uh, filed my pattern uh, when uh, 2021 uh, only okay uh, when when my pattern will be published and it will be granted sir Uh, uh from where where did you file it uh, i filed sir, through that uh, uh, i also having application number also i, I got sir ah. uh through university i filed my patent sir i have done my research in bharat institute of aerospace research in chennai okay through the university uh, one resource person uh, i have filed my patent sir uh, in chennai only am i right in chennai only sir yes ah. sir yes sir yeah yeah okay yeah see uh, in which this march this march yes yes sir yeah okay and hmm. the fees you paid the fees of the university paid i paid sir okay uh, you paid directly to the ipr uh, that, uh, to the chennai uh, patent office yeah. no sir no patent office sir the, through some uh, university some uh, r and d person i paid the amount uh, he paid the amount to the that patent person sir you got the bill for that yeah yes yeah, i got the fees received by mami sir yeah okay see basically that's what i just gave you a live live feedback from one of my student who did the you know filing so yes, uh, normally if it's a uh, normal track mm. it is you know uh, up to you know uh, 18 months time is there for you no know, complete filing 18 months timing is timing is there 18 months okay okay sir. Mm, yeah. okay sir. but if you are going for a fast track fast mm. track we went for a fast track So yes, they will be charging additional for that. Of course, yes. Yeah, in that case, uh, mm. I think uh, they have. They have. I think they have promised before ten months, right? Yes. I think Nino, yes. they promised for before ten months. Am I right? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, yes, sir. In uh, fast track, if you are going, they are saying uh, up to nine months. Maximum yeah, nine, nine months. months. Mm-hmm. Nine to ten months, sir. Uh, yeah, nine to ten months. Your this thing will be. Uh, no. So did they? Did, did you make any? Did they give any corrections or any feedback on that one? No sir, I have tracked that application number, sir. Ah. Uh, in that, I I got response. Uh, your the your the your uh, pattern is went for some person. Uh, uh, but there is no correction. If uh, there is there isn't reply anything, sir. Waiting for some time. Uh, some some amount yeah, of yeah. time. Yeah, yeah. See, normally they will be sending to minimum three, you know, uh, experts. Normally. Okay. Okay. Okay, sir. So that we have to normally what is that? No, if two experts, it is okay. Normally they take it. but sometimes mm-hmm. some regulations they say that they we have to get the you know uh, mm-hmm. approval of all the three experts or in such yes, cases yes. there will be a committee expert committee will be there so okay, that okay. committee uh, may be com- mm-hmm. comprising of three or five people they go mm-hmm. through that one and if they approve mm-hmm. then uh, you know your patent get approved oh okay sir uh-huh, sir okay no not not patent i'm sorry no your patent will be filed and no uh, they will be uh, no if any corrections is there they will intimate uh, you and then your patent okay. will be published okay sir okay yeah. so after correction you, uh, when you give that thing they gave you a file number am i right they gave you a file yes, number yes. 
And that yes, is sorry. a file number. Yeah. So you are now free. Like you can, if you want, you can uh, publish or you can do everything. Once it is filed, it is okay. Nobody can duplicate it. Okay, it sir. is your property only. Only thing yes, is that sir. if there is any corrections or errors are there, that mm -hmm. they'll be making it in this time span. And then okay. only you'll be able to publish it in the, uh, what do you call the nine months, you know? Um, okay, sir. Okay, sir. okay. So these are the, yeah. Uh, any other, shall I complete it or any other queries is there? No, sir. No, sir. Nothing, sir. Yeah. Okay. So these are some of the IPR cells in the universities. I just took only the, you know, uh, Kerala part of it. Yeah. But uh, I said, uh, told you all national part, I have already given all the centers where we have. Uh, this okay. is which we have in uh, Kerala, University of Kerala, in Cochin University, in Kerala Agriculture University, yeah, then Calicut mm -hmm. University, Kannur University, Abdul Kalam University, Kerala Veterinary, and NITC Calicut also we have this one. Okay. okay. And these are some of the references, yeah, mm -hmm. which we have. Okay. And uh, that's all I think. Yeah, if you have any other queries. I think I will be trying to no, share whatever I know. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Yeah. Dear participants, if anyone have any so, queries, uh, you can ask. Yeah, I think we uh, we have yeah some uh, <coughs> participants. I think around. I think more than 30 people, I, I think around 40 yes, people were 40. there. Yeah. So basically, as I told you, I, did, I didn't actually wanted this as a monologue. As I've been telling that I just want this as to be an you know, uh, interaction so that at least some of you people who are here, you should either tell your children, your students, anybody, your friends or relatives, anybody who's having an idea, any concept, please patent it, please. Because this, only this, if each one of us you know, come forward, only, only then we can, you know, we'll be able to you know, increase that index, which I showed you, you know, to come to the topper range. Once we come to the topper range, then that means that you know, the uh, product value or the value for any of the idea or the product, whatever we are making it, that will be unique and you will get paid for that one also. Yeah, if it is internalized or if some companies come care, come and take your product also. That is very, very important. Yeah. So this is a request uh, from my side to all the uh, teachers, students and faculties also or industrials also to have that concept of you know, uh, how you know, we can do the what you call the, you know, the patenting concept. Okay. Any other queries you have? I think I have tried to explain it in a very simple way that you no, know, each and any one of you can you no know, uh, go and you no know, do the patenting part. Yeah, sir. One small request, sir. Yeah, yes, sir. Uh, I am working in Hindu College of Engineering and Technology in Hyderabad. Hyderabad. Yeah. Uh, can I able to provide the same session for me in my college? Can I in a free time? Uh, can I have this same session, sir? Sure, for sir. My, for my faculty members. Surely, sure, sir. Yeah. But uh, my personal request is that. It is better yes, sir. you present it. Whatever yes, help sir. you, what I can give you. <laughs> yes, sir. PPTs and everything you can just share me, sir. I, yeah, I, I, I can. Yes, uh, yeah. But for me, no problem. If you want, I can do that one also. Not a problem. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah, sure, sir. Okay, because no, I, this should be reached to the nook and corner of our country. That is my yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. intention. Yeah, so that no, everywhere no, we can reach and we can do this patenting. So that no, we don't no, go on begging on no, other products for the other country. No, let okay. no, the world come to us. No, we have yes, a lot sir. of intellectuals and no, a lot of people. So that's what I told you when I had been teaching across, you know, outside the country. No, we people, they themselves, you know, we ourselves has been designated. You know, Indian students, Indian brains are good enough. Like, and that's the proof yes. what we have in Google and Microsoft. I don't have to yes. explain that. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> sir, can you share your melody, sir, in our chat box, sir? Can you? My email ID, yes. Sure. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I'll do that. Yeah. Okay, sir. Thank you very much sir, for a nice session. Sir. Thank you. I'm very happy. Uh, yeah, yes, thank you very much. Sir. Thank your, you. Very much. Uh, your uh, Hyderabad chapter member, sir? Uh, chapter, I'm working J to Hyderabad, sir. Okay. Through um, uh, the college, uh, autonomous college. Okay. Yes, okay. I, I put my... Uh, uh, email ID to that one, yeah, and my mobile number also. Yes, sir. Thank you. Yeah. 
थैंक यू सर दिस माय मोबाइल नंबर आल्सो ठीक है Yes, we got it, sir. Uh, thank you. Sir. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yes. Any time, uh, anything related to this one, you can call me. Uh, yes. I'll be very much happy if I'm in a class or in a meeting. I may not take your phone, but I will get back. And the same number is my WhatsApp number also. Ah, uh, sure, sure, sir. Okay. Sure. Yes. Thank, thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Okay, sir. Uh, participant, if anyone have any queries, you can ask. Otherwise, we can wind up. Sajid sir, I think no other queries. No, no, okay. I think I stood up the timing also. Yeah. Yes, sir. Uh, within that timing, I think I was able to complete. <laughs> so in between the connection, and that's why I kept my one more system open so that I can keep communicate. Okay. That's fine. Thank you. Then, uh, sir, I have got a doubt. Yeah. Sir, can you just introduce yourself also whenever you speak? Then that will be appreciated. Yes, sir. Yeah. Sir, I am Roshan Chaudhary from Vishwadi College of Engineering and Technology. I am a second year CS student. Yeah, very good. Uh, so I would like to know that if we have got an idea, do we need to prototype it to get a patent? No. What do you mean by prototype? Like a working model? Need not. Okay. Need not. What you have to do is that you have to prove that that particular thing has to be worked. If you are not going to make a real-time model, you have to prove that your model is going to work. You should have all the mathematical, all algorithm. Say programming, we cannot beat it. You know that. Yeah. Even algorithm okay. also we cannot beat. But you can with that algorithm, this particular thing will work out. If you can prove it, then that will be very good. Okay, sir. Thank you for that. Any other doubt, Kori? You can uh, contact us. Yeah. No problem. I will help okay, you out. Sir. Yeah, so you put an. Uh, are you the CSI uh, uh, student uh, leader? Yes, so my student. Ah, okay, okay, okay. So please spread that uh, message to all other students also. Yeah, in your chat box also. Think about no uh, how you can patent something. Okay, sir. I appreciate that. Yeah, Russian. Thank you, sir. Yeah. Uh, Suresh sir. Minimum. Minimum. Thank you, Asha. Uh, actually, oh. I am I audible? I am in a very yes, in the yes. midst of uh, various very, very other much. disturbances. Sorry, it very was an excellent video. talk. Thank you, Santosh. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Job asking so. Uh, I think uh, Joe Bastin is uh, disconnected. It seems he uh, was traveling yes. otherwise. Ah, yes, sir. Okay. Okay. Uh, anyway, Sandeep sir, it's a wonderful talk, and we are uh, informed uh, very much. And uh, now I would like to invite our vice chairman, sir Sujada ma'am, uh, for what of time? Sujada ma'am. Yeah. 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 Uh, good evening, all. Uh, uh, really happy to know that uh, we have gotten such a wonderful uh, talk, technical talk by Dr. Sandosh Kumar regarding have an idea you can patent. Uh, uh, all will be knowing that lots of inventions are happening around. Uh, so uh, really, it will be helpful for all those students, uh, uh, youngsters, entrepreneurs, and also startups, people, and all. Uh, definitely, you already explained everything in simple steps and all actually. So it was really a nice, excellent uh, um, technical talk actually. So I would I would like to thank on behalf of CSA coaching chapter uh, to Dr. Sandosh Kumar for delivering such a wonderful talk today. Also, I would thank like you. to thank, thank you very much. Yeah. Also, I would thank uh, like to th thank uh, the IT heads from various industries. Uh, namely, Mr. Melvin, Melvin from Joy Alukas, Mr. Tom from KLM, and Mr. Kabildev from IG for joining with us during this technical session. 
Uh, lastly, I would like to thank all the participants uh, who are uh, actively participate in today's technical session. Uh, have a good uh, weekend, uh, nice weekend. Thank you all. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you all. Thank you for the participation. Sandhu sir, thank you sir. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Good night. Good night. Good night. Thanks.